New tonight, local school districts, parents and educators are weighing in after yet another possible change to classroom instruction in Florida. ABC Action News in-depth reporter Rochelle Aline breaks it all down for us tonight. Changes to Florida's education system are causing controversy once again. This comes after the Florida Department of Education announced that it is partnering with PragerU Kids, a conservative-leaning media company. Teachers aren't pushing an agenda. They're pushing to educate children. This is pushing an agenda. A leader with the Florida Education Association released this video claiming the move was a bad one. If people take the videos out of context, I'm sure they can twist it into a pretzel, but that's certainly not what we are teaching here. But speaking to ABC Action News, the company's CEO defended their content. When it comes to material, and the way that is different is our content is completely wholesome and pro-American. It's a move that's also left parents on either side of the debate. The topic sounds good, how to take ownership of your life. Otto's tale to the National Anthem and the Pledge of Allegiance. Cash course using financial institutions. The governor is really hobbling Florida schools right now. And local school districts like Pinellas County are also weighing in. I believe this should not be utilized. So I asked the chief academic officer if it would be used in Pinellas County Schools, and I was informed that the district has no plans of adding these resources to curriculum. In addition to Pinellas County, Polk, Pasco, and Hillsborough County Schools have all told ABC Action News that they have no plans of adding PragerU videos to the curriculum. Both Manatee and Sarasota County Schools have told us they're working to confirm a decision from their curriculum team. But despite these answers, one parent who also works as a local teacher tells us the content can still be used in the classroom whether a district mandates it or not. So a school district saying we're not going to say on Monday you have to teach this PragerU lesson does not mean that a teacher or a big fear is a substitute doesn't go in and say, well, I heard this thing about PragerU, I'm going to pull this up and we're going to learn a lesson. And she's encouraging parents who are concerned to opt their kids out of that potential instruction through their school district. In Tampa, Rochelle Aline, ABC Action News. And to hear Paula Grohn's full interview with the CEO of PragerU, make sure to tune into Full Circle Florida this Sunday morning at 830.